Hi all, Katie Lee here from Katie Lee Creates. Welcome to the next installment of the Great Glimmerbrook Rebuild. Lots of voiceover again today because we are in the midst of some special videos for some special Realm of Magic builds. Just like last week, today's build is a home that I've done for one of three Sim families that I'm playing in my Realm of Magic Let's Play. It takes place on my Twitch channel on Wednesday nights, and this is the second of the three families that I am so excited to introduce you all to. Just like in last week's video, which was about the Blackwells, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the family that will live in each house as some background. That way, if you ever wanted to stop by for a stream, you'll know who the characters are without watching any of the past ones. Just to give you some background information in case you haven't watched the Blackwell video, for this Let's Play, I knew that a number of my characters were going to be young adults, since having children or teenagers that you send away to school makes doing a Let's Play difficult, but I also really don't like my kids to have bad grades in The Sims. So I knew that I was going to have young adults in the Let's Play, and to balance that, since young adults are so heavily represented in The Sims 4 gameplay, I wanted to balance that with a demographic that doesn't get a lot of playtime, in my opinion, which is elders. So my three families are all one elder, a grandmother, and her young adult granddaughter living together in a home. The elders are all experienced spellcasters who were brought up in the ways and each chose a single branch of magic to master while just dabbling in the others. The elders have all been friends since they were young adults and they all live in the same cul-de-sac in Glimmerbrook. Their granddaughters, on the other hand, didn't know anything about the magic realm or the reality of magic even existing until circumstances recently brought them all together. The home that you're seeing right now is for the Avadi family. Grandmother Vashti Avadi was a bit of a practical joker growing up, and that never really left her when she was learning spellcasting as a child, so she is our master of mischievous magic. She's got the Renaissance Sim aspiration because she loves to learn, to read, to experience just all sorts of things. And she's a genius who's outgoing and a vegetarian. And I've already gotten her to some of the San Myshuno festivals so she can learn some of the amazing vegetarian recipes that came with city living. She has a great relationship with her granddaughter Lila Abadi, but she's also very close friends with Emily Blackwell, so she is remaining tight-lipped about the situation with all of our missing mothers that's unfolding in the Let's Play. Vashti's namesake is Shirin Abadi, who is an Iranian human rights activist and a Nobel Peace Prize winner. She is still alive and currently lives in the United Kingdom, and she's been conferred about 18 honorary degrees from a number of prestigious universities, which was a big influence for how I mapped out our grandmother and granddaughter's aspirations and personalities in this family. Vashti's granddaughter, Lila Abadi, is equally on fire for knowledge and exploration, so when she found out that she comes from a lineage of spellcasters, that was basically just one more subject that she could study and master. She is definitely the Hermione Granger of our group, but if Hermione was also Indiana Jones. Lila is an aspiring archaeology scholar who loves to travel the world, and she's cheerful, loves outdoors, and is also a vegetarian, though she is not as good as a cook as Grandma Vashti just yet. For the Let's Play, I am playing with seasons on 28 days long, and I've turned off auto-aging. I'm going to manually age everyone up at one sim calendar year for their respective birthdays, assuming that they all make it that long. Autonomy and Whims are both on for all of our characters. I don't play with any mods or custom content, and I'm rotating one family each week so they all get equal play. Last week we continued our Let's Play with the Abadi family here, and it was definitely a blast, so I hope that you enjoy their home.
Thank you so much for joining me today. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. You can also use the bell icon to turn on notifications so you're never late to a future build. Feel free to leave a comment below if there's a particular build style or a pack combination that you'd like to see in a future video. If you'd like to connect with me outside of YouTube, you can see photos of my past builds and my dog on both Twitter and Instagram where I'm at Katelycreates. Thanks for watching! Thank you.